Well, I hope that this time of Lent has been a special time for you to focus on your relationship with God and to be in the Scripture every day and to uh, spend time talking to God. Let's read today from the book of Numbers a little bit about a description of who God is and how God acts, how God is always faithful and always does what He says. This is Numbers chapter 23 and verse 19. God is not a man that he should lie, nor a son of man that he should change his mind. Does he, does he speak and then not act? Does he promise and not fulfill? We have a God that is faithful. Would you pray with me? God, we, um, I, I'm just so thankful that you're a God who is always faithful you always do what you say, that you're consistent, because so often I'm not. And so I look to you for that stability. God, I'm tempted in so many ways, and yet um, yet you're always true. You're always right. You're always good. So today, God, I I pray that you um, you would correct me. God, that you would forgive me and you would mold me and make me, that you would help me to be more like you. God, we, um, we lift up the ministry that we support as a church one by one that comes alongside um, moms who are in need, single moms who need extra support. Father, I, I pray for that ministry, just the incredible work that they do. I pray for each mother that's a part of that, that you would uh, bless them. God, I pray for all the mentors that uh, participate with that ministry, God, that you would guide them and direct them. Father, I, I pray that you would help us as a church to, to be involved and to make an actual difference and an impact. And God, uh, we, we pray also for, for our next generation, for all of our kids, our youth and our, our children, those that are part of our church, God, I pray that you would help us to just just come alongside our youth ministries and children's ministry, that you would help each one of us to view the kids of our church as our own kids and our job as a whole church to point them towards you. And then, God, would you give us a vision that goes beyond just the kids in our church now to the kids in our neighborhood and our community. They're your kids too. Father, would you help us to reach them? We lift all these things to you, and I pray that you would guide us and direct us today. Would you help me take the right steps today? We pray this in your name. Amen.